What's up people, here Arcana 9 is going to bring another battle and this battle is going to be against Jack. And well, the team that I'm gonna use, uh, I believe it's the same one that I used last, no, it's going to be a little bit different this time. Uh, the team that I will use is the one with the Keldeo, uh, Weavile, uh, I forgot the other name of the Pokemon that I had actually. Uh, but it's, I hope hopefully it's a good battle that you end up liking it and you see that he actually has a really good t uh, team uh, He has some walls in there that will be a uh, Dogsnor, Umbreon, uh, the uh, Wyna, no not the Wyna but Wobbuffet that's what I meant to say uh, As you can see the team that I have is uh, Boroskera, Inteleon, uh, I have my Jolteon and like I said before and uh, Weavile and Kelio. I forgot the name of the other Pokemon, but you know, without further ado, we're just going to start with a battle. And like I said, the battle is going to be against Jack. And well, uh, let's see what Pokemon he's going to send. And he's going to go for the Mr. Mine. And I will send my Ronaldinho Cinderess. Yes, that's the name of my Pokemon. So the first thing I'm going, to, I'm gonna use uh, against this Pokemon is going for the U-turn because it's a neutral damage against that Pokemon. So here's a, a fairy and psychic type. So I went back to the Pokeball and it's time to use a new Pokemon. I will send my Jolteon to see what kind of attack or move he's going to use. And he actually goes for the light screen. And that was shit, cause, because I don't know what kind of set that uh, his Pokemon has, uh, the rest of his Pokemon. So I'm gonna go for the Bolt Switch. And you saw that I was a choice specs. I was able to kill that Pokemon at that range. So now this time I will use my uh, Rarus Kira. I, cause, well, or oh, I will be in Ronaldinho. No, it's my Ronaldinho again, yes, Ronaldinho. Instead of my Baros Kera, so I send my Ronaldinho here, my shiny Pokemon, and he will send actually the what's the name the Pokemon he's going to send right now, and he sends Drapion. Okay, so Drapion has a really good uh, physical defense, but I'm not gonna go for the U-turn because I'm not sure if Pyro Ball it will be enough to KO. But I don't think Pyro Ball. It would have been enough to kill that Pokemon, and even no, I, I didn't even I didn't even know that if I was gonna able to attack with the Pyro Ball because you know sometimes sometimes you miss the Pyro Ball Pyro Ball. So now I'm gonna send my Barrow Kira, and I am fast. He actually goes for Stuck Spike, so he, well a lot, a lot of his Pokemon is uh, they are like uh, you know like. Uh, one of them was like uh, with uh, light screen. Uh, he has the toxic spike. Um, I'm gonna go for liquidation to try to kill this Pokemon, and I get to KO the Drapion with just one attack. I mean, eventually I did a damage before with uh, with my Cinderace. So now we send Rotom. I'm not sure if I am faster or not about his Rotom. He might be faster or not, so I'm gonna predict that he's gonna go for a bolt switch. So on the switch, I will send my Jolteon, you know, predicting, like I said before, predicting the bolt switch. I got poison, my Pokemon got poison. And he goes for the, the chart, since I, uh, I have all absorbed, and that damage or that attack didn't do anything against my Jolteon. And well, I will go for the Shadow Ball because it's super effective against that Pokemon. Uh, I believe he's not. I believe he's not gonna. St he's not. He's not gonna stay with his Pokemon. Uh, pretty sure he's gonna make a switch because he knows that my Pokemon has a Shadow Ball. So as he made the switch, he's gonna send the Umbreon. And Shadow Ball is not super effective against that Pokemon and Umbreon has a really good uh, defense, a special defense. And I don't want my Jolteon to faint because of the poison because I know that most of the time Umbreon, ha Umbreon has Protect and Wish 
and all the stuff. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to make a switch and I will send my Keraldeo. Just to see what attack he's gonna go, or what, what attack, what move he's gonna go for. He's gonna go for foul, uh, Dark Pulse actually. And since a Dark type, and because of my ability, my attack is going to raise me plus one, but Keldo doesn't have the best physical attack. So that raise, it didn't actually matter at all. So I'm gonna go for my Cold Mine because I'm gonna raise my special attack and my special defense. And I don't know if he's gonna stay or not with his Pokemon. He's gonna make a switch actually. He's gonna make a sw switch. And he's gonna send the Rotom. And I went for the Cold Mine like I said before. So I'm gonna be plus one. And special attack, special attack and special defense. I know I can outspeed his Pokemon. I am gonna go for the Hydro Pump. Hopefully I don't miss the attack because Hydro Pump is like 85% accuracy. And he's gonna Dynamax his Rotom Electric Ghost type. But I believe I am faster. I, I wasn't sure yet because that's why I made a switch before with uh, my, my with my Baros Kira. So I would say with my Pokemon here, I was like, you know, YOLO, I go for the Hydro Pump, and I actually am able to KO the Hydro, uh, the Rotom, and I was able to outspeed. That means he, I don't know what kind of item he had. So I, I'm losing so much speed because of the poison, oh, and now uh, he will send the uh, Wobbuffet. So I'm gonna go for my Hydro Pump one more time and to see how much damage I can do against this Pokemon but I'm going to miss my attack and he went for Mirror Coat. So I was like, oh shit. So it's a good thing that I missed my attack because now I'm pretty sure she's, I'm pretty sure, pretty sure he's gonna go for Mirror Coat again. So I'm gonna go for the Coal Mine so I can raise my special attack in special defense. Now, now this time, now this time I'm going to be plus uh, I might be able to outspeed this Pokemon. Uh, I might, I might be able to KO this Pokemon being plus two and special and a special attack. So let's see how it goes. I went for the Hydro Pump against that Wobbuffet, and I'm not going to miss my attack, and I will KO the Wobbuffet with just one attack. Now he has a Dark Snor, I believe he still has Dark Snor. Uh, he still has the Umbreon. Right, so I'm gonna go for the Hydro Pump because I'm pretty sure that I can kill this Pokemon. Let's go for the Hydro Pump. And uh, let's see the damage. Let me see if he's able to survive or not. Uh, no, he's not gonna be able to survive the attack. He will KO with just one attack. So the last Pokemon that uh, he has, it is the Umbreon, and not survive. I still survive with 10 HP. So that means I can KO the rest of his Pokemon or his Pokemon. That's the only Pokemon that he has left. So he goes Umbreon. So I just want to make sure that I'm actually able to kill this Pokemon even if he goes for Protect. So I'm gonna Dynamax, Dynamax my Pokemon and I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for the Max Knuckle because it is super effective. Even though he goes for Protect, I believe I can kill his Pokemon being plus two and, and special attack. And uh, the Dynamax can pass that pro the Protect. So I went for the max knuckle against that Umbreon and I'm gonna be able to kill his last Pokemon and that's gonna be the battle against Jack. So this is Arcanine 9 or Crypto Arcanine actually because I changed my name. Uh, see you next time, later and bye guys.